Hey guys, welcome back to The Good Show. I'm back with another video, or we're back with another video. And it's this video. Uh, we're gonna be setting up my um, bait tank. We, yes, we have everything set up. We just gotta fill it up with water, which isn't really hard. Sorry for that pause, I thought something was home. Looks like my fish are doing good. They're doing good. Let's see that. The schools should be doing fine. Can't really find any of the. There's, there's a sucker. Right there. And Sam. Well, that's it pretty much, but. Here, I'm gonna get to you guys when I have this hose over by the tank. Alright, I just also wanted to show. I didn't have my video filming at 4K, I only had an HD at 60 FPS, but I switched it to 4K at 60 FPS, so this should be running a lot better, but I got the hose, and basically, that's knotted. Um, all of the glue should have dried, we did some silicone work on the pump, because we were trying to put it together, but the one part cracked. So that isn't very good. Oh shoot. Uh, we have this plastic in there for um you know helping with what's it called? With um it's a natural filter which the plastic is. So I'll get you guys whenever this is filled up and it starts filling up that tank. Alright, so you know it is kinda loud, but it shouldn't be that since the rain falls are hitting over the rocks. But it shouldn't be that loud to start. It looks like the pump's running okay. One down till it's not reaching to the sides. I think that's because there's not a lot, a lot, enough water right now. Or it might be the change we had to do to the pump. But that might be okay for none of the uh, like rainfall over there. But I'll probably get, uh, I will get back to you guys whenever the whole container is, you know, halfway. I might throw a little time lapse here soon. about a quarter way up I just didn't feel like holding the time lapse there that long so I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do today I have a pool party for lacrosse so I might film some at that I don't know but I'm just gonna wait till that's filled up I need to go to that fish place so I can get a hundred feeder guppies because um they produce like bacteria really easily so I'm just gonna throw them in that tank it should only be like 15 bucks I think they're 15 cents a piece if I can find my money, that'd be good. But yeah, so I'll get to you guys whenever that tank's full. I didn't end up filming yesterday. I'm not 100% sure why. I don't even know. Oh yeah, I had my lacrosse party. I did finish my tank, but right now I am on my way to that fish place. Uh, which, I forget where, how far away it is. But I'm going to get about 100 or so feeder guppies to throw in that tank just for either food for the bluegills, but they're also gonna help like get the bacteria and everything running. So I'll see you guys when I get Welcome back to the good show. Um, yeah, this is probably the next, this is the next day after that fish place. Uh, Mason, Colin and I went to Risser's and we um, didn't really film a lot. Like Mason said in the previous video of him showing the fish tank that, well, I saw the fish tank off one road it said free and was one of the wanted to get it, so. But, uh, you saw his. We kind of just did that for fun. Sorry, Mike, but some, I just woke up. Um, so yeah. I'm coming down to this tank. And I'm just gonna check it out, see if any fish are dead. I had a hundred, like, um, rosy reds just to circulate the water. And kind of put some bacteria in it. But, um, I also got some bluegill, so. Let's see what's in there. Right. Uh, a lot of the fish, and I'll turn this, usually you can't see. I guess a lot of them went to the top, and are in here now, which is okay, because you can guess they can get bacteria in there. I might scoop them out and put them in. But I'm just going to wait for this water to be dirty. Catch some. He's dead, I think. He's dead. Alright, I 
get some high ones. You can see. Well, let's go over here. You can see the bluegill in the back corner. Looks like they're, they're hiding in the rock. I think that's one right there. Yeah, that might be. I think you got some over there in the corner. Mainly over there. I'm gonna need a bigger net because they can just run away from this for me whenever I'm trying to get them out. Let's get just a little overview of fish. Yeah. So, yeah, that's pretty much all I wanted to show you guys. It's just, I, uh, <clears throat> it's been harder to film because I don't really know anything that I can film. And it's kind of, I don't have anything around at my house. But Mason's house is a lot better to film at. He's a lot. Let's turn the filter. He has a lot of stuff going on at his house. So, let's grab this plug. Use the camera. I guess it's just a simple pump from there and from here to create circulation and oxygen flow. See, like I was saying, it's harder for me to film because I don't have anything here. But I'm basically just going to be filming that, my other tank. And Mason got the beta fish, which he's keeping in his room, I think, as well as the bigger tank. And they're really cool. They're cool tanks because you can, like, design them. They look really cool. I might grab one because... Oh, look, they're not super expensive. It's like everything else I have done there and everything else he has at his house. So it's a plus. And yeah, that was basically just an update for my bait fish tank. So uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, and also last video, Mason posted of his new tank. Uh, not the bait of fish one, the new one. The most recent video besides this one. Um, go to that video and... Put your name and why you want to win the giveaway. And then you can win the $10 giveaway for 50 subscribers. So, see you guys in the next video. See ya.